Bow, bow. YouTube, what's the righteous word? It's your boy Gangland Neem, aka Neeman. I be for the E. Golly, I don't know y'all. Remember that. And we back with another video. So we got loose coochie cannon. Now everybody know that this dude is a complete liar. He been trying to lie on Big U for I don't know how long. Nobody believes him now. I even heard one of his minions turned on him. They're no longer friends. Now, since none of that stuff is working for him, he's got a new victim. And it seems like it's Ralphie the Plug. Again, I want to let y'all know, please don't believe anything that this man says, but I just want y'all to hear how stupid he sounds saying it. Now, if this is your first time to the channel, please. Like, subscribe, comment, and share, please, and thank you. We need that for the algorithm. If you could go to the top of the page, smash that Instagram link, follow me on Instagram, shoot me any content y'all want me to react to there. Also, join up in the Discord. Good people, positive vibes all the time. I can't tell y'all that enough. Smash that TikTok link to follow me over there for any content that I post over there as well. But again, this is one of CS2 backs minions. You know what I'm saying? He's part of the web of lies. All this guy does is lie. And with him specifically, it's just like, bro, he's so super slow. Um, respectfully, it's like, bro, nobody believe that shit anyway, bro. You're too slow to do half of the shit that you say you're out here doing. Just my opinion. You know what I'm saying? But let's get into this. <laughs> let's get into this content. For the hard truth. What's up? Listen, we about to tell the hard truth about a sweetie pie. I mean, the ultimate buster. The ultimate person that let his brother get killed and did not want to put in no work. The ultimate person that let his brother get killed and didn't want to put in no work. I don't even understand how... That sentence works, but this is what I'm talking about. This guy's slow. So, sweetie, sweetie, Ralphie the plug, complete sucker. It's just horrifying to meet somebody and be a part of some, something that you representing your whole life and find out that he wanted Draco the ruler spot. His own brother. He did what Big U was doing to Nipsey. This nigga's slow as hell. This nigga look like a mole rat with an NY fitted on. Now, again, he always want to bring things back to Big U and Nipsey. So, he don't got nothing else to talk about. Again, these are all lies, but I just want you to see how stupid he is lying. I'm going to break it down. This is real life facts. <laughs> a super buster. Uh, a sweetheart. So... Me and Draco, right? We in the studio. We recording and stuff. And then he was talking to me. He was like, man, I got this last song I'm about to do or whatever. Um, I want you to um, be a part of it. He said, matter of fact, I want it to be your song or whatever. So I was like, cool. So we doing behind the... <laughs> I should tell you this. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to this goofball. That shit don't even sound right. Draco the ruler told you that he wanted to just give you a song for why? Por qué? Why, bro? Have you have you guys ever heard a banging loose cannon song? I didn't even know this nigga was a rapper, bro. I can't even lie to you. I didn't even know bro was a rapper until I saw the Draco song and booty ass song. Everything Draco get on is heat. Why this wasn't? Just throwing that out there, bro. But you said that this was 
your song. Draco told you this is your song, like Nipsey told you. Yeah, like you the future. <laughs> this nigga is out of his mind, y'all. Pay attention. Footage or whatever with the you know camera and everything like that, filming the scenes, filming us from me making a beat to actually writing a hook and doing the hook and stuff. Ain't no way. And you know, just making magic, right? Or a song called Ball Out. So the fact is, it's like this. So I told what well, Draco, we were just talking. He was like, man, I got this show. I want you to come. I just don't feel right. And then he showed me the lineup. And I'm like, on six, so like, bro, you got to change that lineup. Go to a different stage because that's not it. And then I told him, I said, I got prior engagements or whatever to go and do a, a song or whatever, right? So I was like, I had some shows lined up in New York. So I said, when. Where is Loose Cannon rapping at? Again, I never heard no song from Bro except the Draco song. Where is Loose Cannon rapping at? He talking about he has some shows in New York. Where? Where? Do y'all know he rap? Have y'all ever heard he rap? Maybe I'm just out the loop or something. Did y'all know he rap? I don't even know he could string together lyrics to rap. He can even string a, together a sentence to talk, let alone rap in a cadence. Like, I don't know anything about this. Do y'all know? Y'all comment down below. Let me know what y'all know about Loose Cannon's music. Because I never heard of it. When I get back, we could shoot the actual video. He was like, okay, cool, no problem. Let's do it. Let's 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 work. So he was like, just make sure you come back. I was like, okay, cool. I'm going to come back. You just be safe, right? So while I'm in New York, I get a call talking about Draco died. I'm like, Draco didn't die. Shut up. So I hang up. Next thing I know, his mama called. When his mama called, they was like, Draco is really dead. I'm like, what? Hey, see, I get online, I see the video and stuff like that. I see the bus ride activities. I see everybody running. The whole stick team. So, I'm ready about to come back, fly back. So, I'm pressing everything. Yeah. I don't believe Draco Mama called this nigga either. Straight up, I'm gonna let y'all know I'm trying to debunk this whole thing. I don't believe Draco Mama called this nigga. For what? Why would she call you, gang? Like, who are you? Why would she call you? Niggas gotta start telling more believable lies. That's how I feel at this point. It's like, dog, if you're gonna do this for a career, like this lying, you gotta start making intricate lies. Things that might seem like they could be true. You get me? This don't seem like it could be true, gang. For real. Slow cannon. And homies. Pressing everything. And then I get on the phone. I call Ralphie. I'm like, Ralphie, what happened? Ralphie tell me the story like, man, I told Draco, like, the line. And why when somebody about to die or they just died or something, niggas get on the phone and call loose cannon. Like, I'm just, I'm confused at that. Like, such and such die. Call loose. What? Never. Never, ever. And it wasn't cool or whatever. I didn't feel right. But nobody was going to stop him because he wanted to go and get his 50 bands. And I'm like, yeah. And then I was like, so what happened? He was like, they searched us. Or whatever. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> this nigga is not smarter than a fifth grader, bro. Like, this is crazy. But they let everybody else in with with everything. And I said, how many of that? How many of y'all? He was like, it was like 15 of us. I was like, yeah. I said, so what happened? He was like. We was 
fighting. Next thing I know, I see Draco sitting on a speaker and he got stabbed or whatever like that. And I'm like, okay, so y'all didn't try to help him. Y'all didn't try to do anything like that. He was like, he sat on the speaker and he just gave up. He was tired. He was winded. I was like, this is a conversation that Ralphie the plug had with him about his brother's death right after his brother's death. That's not even believable, gang. I'm sorry. That's not believable. Look at his face. Looks like the face of a liar. Look like he got a rash on his nose, too. Eat some ointment, bruh. So, y'all didn't try to pick him up. Y'all didn't try to do anything, right? Then Sweetheart told me, he was like, no, it was just everybody for themselves after that. I said, what? So, I'm, it ain't clicking, right? So I'm telling them, I'm like, bro, I'm about to come outside. I got the, we about to troop up. So I'm going to call you so you can meet me because I know who did it, right? So basically, he's saying online right now, which is a lie, because who would even say this? He's lying on online saying, yo, I called him and told him, hey, get ready, because we about to go slide on who did this. Why niggas still ain't slide? What's going on here, bro? And why this lie right now? Like, are the views doing that bad? Are you not clouded up enough where you have to make lies like this? R.I.P. Draco, for real. Because niggas don't even need to hear stories like this. If you respect any of these men who pass, you wouldn't even tell stories like this. Disgusting, bro. And it's a lie. That's what's crazy to me. You using Draco's name and his brother's name to get more clout. Like, you don't respect Draco. That wasn't your friend. Bam. So I'm calling, blowing Ralphie up. Like, dead homie. Like, what's up? Like, texting him and all that stuff, right? He finally called me back. He was like, listen, Kenan, I don't want to be too much tripping or anything like that. Because I have a career now, and I know what happened to my brother and stuff like that. It's hard, but I got a career to think about. That's what Ralphie the Plug told Loose Cannon on the phone about his brother dying. That don't even sound right, bro. Who are you? For bro to even be saying any of this, who are you? I'm just so confused these lies have reached new levels bro it's crazy like bro do some reactions or something <laughs> like bro get on here and just cut content do some reactions bro it's that easy you don't got to get up on here and lie straight up and then people elsewhere they follow this kind of information and they be like oh yeah ralphie the plug was crying on the phone to loose cannon and it's like no he wasn't bro but again, people who's not from where we from, they don't know what's going on. They don't know this guy like that. They'll take this and believe this story. This is fake. Again, I just want to show y'all this nigga reaching new levels with the clout. Like, bro, this man's dead. R.I.P. Draco again. This nigga's dis disgusting. I'm like, what? I'm like, you a buster. Dead homies. I'm like, sweetheart. When I catch you, it's up. Now, because bro don't want to slide, allegedly, he don't want to slide with you. He's a buster. And now you're going to diss him online. He just lost his brother. But that's what you go. <laughs> but that's what you go do. He's a buster. Super buster. I think he's, I think Luce is a super buster for all these lies he do. Like, bro, what, what, what is the point of all this? Like, really, what's the point of all this? Niggas can't even rest in peace no more because niggas like this. Like, come on, bro. So the moral of the story is like this. <laughs> the moral of the story. Your own brother would be looking at you jealous, envious, want what you want. And if that's your real brother... You supposed to die with him. You supposed to 
do everything. Like, why leave the bag? Why leave the man that put you in a position? <laughs> that should be the first person that get up out of there, right? Let me know, people, if I'm tripping. But loose, you're lying. And you're tripping. Straight up. Sweetheart, another part of the Buster Avengers, Ralphie the Plug. Sweetie, you was a real life Mark. You acted like you was so tough on records and you do this and do that. Then people, he tells me, Draco wasn't right ever since he got out of jail. His head was messed up. No. He was just... No. <laughs> he was just militant. This nigga on here with the flu line. I was wondering what all that redness was around his nose. He on here with the flu line. Shame on, bro. He was a rider. He was something that you wish you could be. And you was a, just a sucker waiting for his demise so you could come up. But right now, mm -mm, I had a soon ball out. And since I started talking about him and telling the world how much of a coward he is, he wants to have the Drake away state remove my song. Dead homies. And the crazy part about it is, I gave all the royalties and the mechanics to his son. But he thinking that song will blow up and then put me on. No, I don't need that. I'ma expose you. You's a sucker. You not like that. You wanted your brother's spot. But it's not working for you. The people don't buy in. You a snake. <laughs> and that's it. Dead homies. <laughs> this nigga slow as hell. And um, for the record, Luce, we don't believe you either, bro. You've been caught in too many lies. You... CS2 Backlamore, the little minions you used to run around with who don't even mess with you no more. They done exposed all your lies, phone calls, and everything else. You don't even trust whack. I wonder when that marriage is going to end. You know what I'm saying? Again, this guy don't got nothing else to talk about. Make reactions or something, bro, because that's what it seemed like you want to be in front of the camera. Just make reactions, dog. You don't got to make up lies. R.I.P. Draco the Ruler, and shout out Ralphie the Plug. You know what I'm saying? But um, I just wanted to play this for y'all because I knew it was a lie. And it's just funny watching him lie. It's funny watching him try to string together thoughts to make these stupid ass videos. I'm going to be honest with you. You know what I'm saying? First it was Big U. Now it's Draco. You know what I'm saying? It's just weird, bro. It's just weird. And none of these guys are to be believed. Pay attention. And he got the flu. Nigga need to be laid up somewhere. Sipping tea or something. Nigga, get your shit together. Instead, you online, lying on Ralphie the Plug. That weak-ass ball-out song. I'm not even gonna lie. I hate to say it because Draco is on the song, but that song is Kaka. Kakando. Basura. Garbito. Now... <laughs> If this is your first time to the channel, please like, subscribe, comment, and share, please. And thank you. We need that for the algorithm. If you can go to the top of the page, smash that Instagram link. Follow me on Instagram. Shoot me any content y'all want me to react to there. Also, join up in the Discord. Good people, positive vibes all the time. I can't tell y'all that enough. Smash that TikTok link to follow me over there for any content that I post over there as well. Now, <clears throat> for anybody looking for any type of youtube uh or social media promotion whether that's facebook instagram tiktok youtube contact at drea the virgo on instagram again that's at drea 
the Virgo on Instagram. Serious inquiries only. She's working with a bunch of different content creators. You need some help with your views, thumbnails, viewer retention, monetization, whatever it is. Contact at Drea the Virgo on Instagram. A lot of y'all running in the um, brick walls or hurdles y'all can't get over. And um, I know how that be because I went through that too. But contact at Drea the Virgo on Instagram. She can help you with all that. Serious inquiries only. But y'all comment down below and let me know what y'all think of this bullshit. Because that's exactly what it is. It's your boy Gang Lanine. Peace.